Hi guys, Cheesy Moose here, and we are back playing some more Animal Crossing Happy Home Paradise. As you see here, uh, I just loaded in and I was going to start the video after we get to start picking the client, but apparently I've got something a little different for you this time. Remember when we looked at that empty facility together? Oh my, the lore is going crazy at the beginning of the video. Well, we got the necessary permits to turn it into a school. Oh my gosh, this is great news. Let's pretend to be into it. It is. I was impressed with the permitting process. It was much quicker than I expected. This is an important moment in our history of paradise planning. Yes, nice screaming at my face for that. Our very first facility. That's why I need your help putting it together. Let's over there now, shall we? This is so exciting that we just get to start doing this right away. Designing our school. For some reason we have a school here. I don't really know why. None of these people have kids or anything. Maybe it's for like university classes or like life classes or financing classes, you know? You know, maybe I'll teach them how to design houses and then they can be as good as me. And I think we should start by freshening up the exterior. It could really use some personality. Oh my! Are you saying I get to make this look how I want? Okay, well, yeah. There's not a whole lot here, just a bunch of different colors. Uh, what's the, what if we just do black, just an entirely black school, you know, uh, so that it really just, eh, the bell has to be gold, because the bell just looks silly any other color. You know what, I want a completely purple school. Can we do, that? there's no purple roof that's, um, it's kind of sad. What's a really weird mix of colors, actually? Orange roof. Uh, side of the house is going to be aqua blue. The door is orange. And the bell is still purple. Yeah, okay. That's That looks silly enough, I guess. Wow. Yep. Great. It looks wonderful. That taken care of. Let's head inside. Oh yes, this school looks really good. Time to uh, set up a good education place. This is a really small school. Looks like we need a lot of work in here. I'm so glad you're helping me out with this. So first things first. A school needs chairs and desks, right? I disagree completely. I don't think it needs any of that. I think you just need to sit on the floor and just Listen to the teacher read out the slides, and then you're ready for the world. Although this room size, eyes will start feeling pretty cramped if we add too much furniture. Oh, ding dong. I know just the thing. Technique to adjust the size of the room. Just hold on, I'll trigger the tray. So if the room feels too large or too small for your various, for your vision, press to decorate, switch to your decorating mode. From there, press that to begin adjusting the size of the room. Can we just make this room absolutely massive? Easier done than said. So. Can we just make this absolutely massive? We can. We're making this as big as possible. Oh my gosh, this is huge. <laughs> I kind of like the aesthetic of no windows because it really just gives you that school vibe of you're just imprisoned. Um, oh, we can also choose what's here. You know, a nice red carpet to just get you go or that good tile floor. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. There we go. This is absolutely massive. That is what we like to see. Okay. Okay, so we need a certain amount of things. I feel like the foldable chairs, but there's basic school chairs and foldable chairs. They're all looking, those are kind of looking what we're, uh, what we kind of need uh, in this school. Oh, you can have, yeah, there's the projection screen. Okay, and you can have toilets in here. 
Okay, I want, first thing I want is I just want every single kind of chalkboard and whiteboard thing imaginable in here. We're just putting it all in here. Um, you can have a TV with a VCR, that's pretty cool, but... Uh, your chessboard, very school-like. Where? Okay, there's a lot of things we can actually add here. Okay, but first we should probably get the floors down. No. Green rubber flooring. Blue rubber flooring. The blue just seems like a school floor, really. No. 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 She maybe. Eh. I'm not so sure about that. It's not... I do like this concrete wall feel. You know, that concrete wall is... That's the move for right now. Now, I know we don't have any desks or whatever, but we're just gonna pretty much make this just like a math classroom with every single thing possible here. And this, come here. Nope, I didn't mean to remove that. I didn't want to... Okay. Well. Here. Let's... Put that there. Put that there. That's looking real nice. The projector right there. Um, can we fit both of these in the corner there? I don't think we're going, no, we're not gonna be able to fit both of them. So I may just shove that in here. We have a nice whiteboard in the, the, the corner right here. Another chalkboard right there. Yeah. Honestly, looking looking nice. Okay, I'm pretty sure we need that the podium thing. Okay, podium. You go right here. Dead, well, almost. Yeah, it's about center. Where you give your nice lecture on why your slides are important. Uh, what else could we have in our epic school? Um, I love how we have all these bathroom options. I think it really, it really adds to the, the mood. And then, you know what, actually, we're gonna give the the teacher, I don't know who the teacher's gonna be, but they're gonna have their own, like, you know the teacher's corner where they just have their own setup? We're gonna make him one of those, or she, I don't know who the teacher is, or maybe we're the teacher. And they always have that nice chair for some reason, you know? What else can we add? For the teacher? Uh, hmm. What's something fitting to put in the teacher's, on the teacher's desk? The TV, of course. We're gonna need that. And also, I feel like the teacher really needs a gnome. You can put things on the TV. That, that adds a whole new level of options right there. Now, oh, okay, come here, chair. You're on right there. Look at that. So good. Yeah, there's gonna be a gnome on the TV. Oh, apparently I can't put the gnome on the TV when the TV's on something. So you wanna know what, the gnome's just gonna chill there. Or, I think I wanna move the desk just back one for better spacing, so. There we go, that way they can actually get on the chair. Okay, now, I believe it's time for us to work on the actual class setup. Uh-huh, so, I don't know how many students we're expecting here, though. That is way too big of a desk that I was thinking. Um, you know what, it's fine. We'll just have them, two people per desk here, and then we're just gonna line as much as the of these up as we possibly can and then just see where it goes from there okay 
this is uh, this is the classroom so far. Um, not bad. Now I think we simply just need to fill it with these folding chairs because we definitely have a budget here. Okay, so this is the setup I have going on so far. We have all these pairs and then two sets of solo desks for those weird kids. Now, what else can we add? Let's look for stuff to put on the walls. Yeah. Okay. Study poster. That's just the ABCs. That's kind of sad. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't really know about any of this stuff. We'll have the exit sign. But I want two of them, and I want them to be facing each other so that it confuses people. Can I not rotate this? Apparently not. That's kind of really sad. You wanna know what? Let's just have an exit sign right there. And then another one right there, really setting the mood in. And at the front of the class, you always gotta have that clock that everyone's just watching and is most likely broken right there above the projector. Perfect placement. Uh, hold on, I wanna go back to the wall. And then I assume we just gotta fill it out with like the map and the ABCs and this and that all this stuff that's not really super important yeah look at that mmm ooh the map yes and the ABC's mm-hmm mm-hmm and then whatever this is over here yes okay a formal paper. Hmm, I don't know about that. I don't think we're very formal in this school. Um, okay, that's good. Now for the ceiling, these are the, these lights. We're just gonna fill them up with this light, these lights. Because that's what an actual school is. It's just full of them. All right, let's just see how much we can go here. We're just gonna keep going until it can't fill them out anymore. And now we're not even gonna put them in a proper line, we're just gonna let it be. Nice. Yeah, that seems about right. And uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think we're done here for our school. All right, how are things going? I am finished. Great. Next thing we need to do, well, who, who can we invite to work here? You can always change the staff later. Who can we hire right now? Uh, I'd rather not hire her. Oh, are you serious? It has to be her? We can change her outfit. Oh, and we can change the member too. But it has to be someone who lives here. Yeah, Pudge was rich. But this tiger, look at this guy. All right, change outfit. We got to get him in the most drippy teacher outfit ever. I like the glasses. Is there anything Oh yes, very, so there we go. Sophisticated, can we put pants on this guy or no? I'm assuming not, considering there's no pants options. However, there's hat options and a bunch of glasses options. However, I'm not seeing a, a whole lot of, okay, here's some more hat. Oh, that small hat is kind of sassy though, okay. There's so many good hat options. Shades. 
That's complex, but that just fits well. That's it. That's the that's the fit. It's this guy. This is our guy. This is the teacher. He is our man. Okay, I'll go call our new teacher. Wait, before we do this, we will need to give our school a name. Oh boy, oh boy. If we don't have any ideas, I want to... Yeah. Alright, let's give it a name. Alright. What were you thinking? I wonder how long it'll let us... Uh, let's see, what's a good name? Uh... Hmm... A totally legit school. Totally... Hold on. You know, we're just going to call it the real school. The real education zone, actually. That's definitely what it should be called, if it let if it has that amount of space. Education zone. I don't know what they'd even teach in this school, man. The real education zone. Yep. That sounds about right. It's not grammarly correct, but that definitely is what our school stands for. Okay. Nice. All oh, people are in class. Let's look at this. That's the photo right there. Yes. Look at how educated they're being right now. Our man's just teaching, or it looks like he's sort of preaching actually. And they all look super happy there. And by super happy, I mean not super happy. Tell him, Mr. Tiger. Wow. That was great. What a montage. Pretty crazy. Well, I called everyone. Once I got our teacher near, it seemed like we needed some students too. And now everyone is learning, thanks to you. Oh, we should take a photo. I, I did that. After. Okay. Well, we have a beautiful one on the inside here. Da, da real education zone. Yeah, that's that's us, all right. I don't know. Can I talk to this guy? See what he's thinking. Nope. Okay. Sick. Bro, it's not letting me sit on a chair. That kind of sucks. But you know, I'm just gonna teach it, sit on the teacher's desk because I want to. First, let's turn on the TV. Um. And then let's just sit back. And yeah, good teaching. Okay, let's head out. Get me out of this place. Ah, uh, wait a second. You didn't tell me you wanted to go. All right, what's up? Let's take that photo. Let's be done with this whole operation. Alright, it's kind of cool that we have the school, but I don't really understand the point of it in our village. Like, what's being taught here. Oh, look at look at our amazing guy. He's just looking so real. To take a, celeb uh, a celebratory photo. There we go. Yeah. Thanks for... This little island is a little more beautiful today, thanks to me and the real education zone. It's not even capitalized. That's how real it is. Can't wait to see what the future holds for the students and teachers. Alright, we need to hear from 
person in charge of decorating the school zone. A few words? We did it, team. I'm so happy. I'm saying some words. That's all I have to say. And at least, but not least, let's take that photo. Mm. You know, the monkey can be slightly cut off because I don't really care about him. All right, eyes. Wow, isn't that just majestic? What do you think of the photo? It's perfect. I don't think we need to take any more photos ever. Take care, everyone. Wow. Okay, so now we have a school up. I'm not exactly sure where this place is going. Woo! I know. I think we did a great job. Right. I went to take a peek inside. What a good looking school. It's so nice. I bet I'd do well even in my worst subjects. I doubt it, Nico, my enemy. Wardle was impressed with how polished everything looks, too. Thank you, Wardle. Wardle's my man. I agree. Our school is top notch thanks to me. Well, yeah, the education system's kind of failing right now, so I agree. We're probably we're probably in the top ten schools right now. The Lodi totter and blah 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 blah. So that means whoa. What is it, Nico? I've just come up with a brilliant idea. Hehe. <laughs> But I'm going to keep it to myself for now. Oh my gosh. Can we not argue about his dumb idea? Very large job. Oh my. Oh my goodness. That's a lot. I'm rich and I haven't spent any. Because. We have to be growing the client basis. And because it needs saying blah blah blah. Okay, that's that's cool. Yeah, I think we're calling it a day. I'm done with you. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, we got the school up, which is what we're grinding for. I don't know how many videos it's gonna take us to get this whole island complete, because there's so many buildings, and it took us so long to get the school. But uh, yeah, we got it. If you did like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. That way you don't miss out on any more of these Animal Crossing videos. Or just any more Cheesy Moose content in general. And uh, yeah. I'm Cheesy Moose. And I will see you next time. Preach, my brother. Preach.